So, for example, I am taking one web application. I am taking one web application. I am taking one web application. This is the web application. In the web application, we have web elements, button, link, edit box, select box, set box, radio box, button, all are web elements. All are web elements. Mm. All are web elements. Each and every web element are having one unique location. Unique location. Unique location. Each and every web element are having one unique location. That is called X path. That unique location and the So uh, we need to find out the unique location that is called X path. We need to find out. So how to find okay. out? I will tell you. Each and every web element having one unique location that is called X path. We need to find out that X path. How to find out the X path? If you want to find out the X path, we need to have one fire path. We need to have fire path. We need to have fire path. What is fire path? Fire path is nothing but it is a odd on of Firefox. It is a Add on of Firefox. That means we can get in only Firefox only. It is a add on of Firefox. So which is used for find the which is used for finding the X path of the web element. X path of the web element. Finding the X path of the web element. X path of the web element. So next to firebug. Firebug is nothing but it is also odd on of Firefox. That means we can get in only Firefox. It is a odd on of Firefox, which is used for inspecting the web element. Inspecting the web element. So if you want to find out the XPath compulsory, we need to have these two things, Firebug and Firepath. Okay. So Firepath, where we can get in Firebug. So first of all, we need to download Firebug as well as Firepath. <laughs> Inspecting, inspecting means just we are inspecting the web element just to find out just we are inspecting inspecting the web element so for example for example i will show you i'm going to facebook so this is the facebook page this is the firebug So this is firebug. What is this? Firebug. Fire this is fire path. X path we can get here. X path we can get here. X path we can get here. So, for example, so these are the, oh, this is edit box. This is one web element. This is also one okay. edit box. This is one web element. Login button. This is one web element. So all are web elements. So this is one web element. This is one web element. So all are web elements. Each and every web application having web elements. So we need to find out the web elements. How to find out the web elements? So compulsory, we should have X path. So for example, if I want to work with this uh, email, so keep the cursor on that. First of all, we need to activate. So this, this window, each and every time we should activate this one. We should activate each and every time. If I want this uh, email XPath, just activate it and click on, go and click on it. So we can get XPath here. Go, this is the XPath. Not only XPath, each and every web element having some other properties also. So ID property. And type property, value property, name property. We have different different properties. So not only using XPath, yesterday we discussed XPath concept. Today we can take the properties. Today we can take the properties. And the ID one you would have location it trace JSA when same yes. XPath laga. Ah, yes, just like uh, XPath is nothing but it is a unique location. ID is nothing but just like it is a ID, unique ID. Each and every web element okay. having one unique ID. Each and every web element having unique type. Each and every web element okay, so having... Okay, so basically, pull out your properties, but you can get that. Yes, we can identify the web elements. Okay. Hmm. 
not only using the XPath, we can take the other properties also. So, first configure Selenium WebDriver programs. Right click on project, go to properties, Java build path, libraries, add external jars, choose all jars. Yes, configure, just we are configuring Selenium WebDriver. This is only Eclipse. So, we need to configure Selenium WebDriver programs into Eclipse. Okay. Already we have Selenium WebDriver programs. We need to configure. Mm. How to okay. configure? Yes, once again I am teaching. So. Okay. Uh, yes, once if you do, uh, yes, enough. Just go to properties, Java build path, libraries, add external jars, choose all jars, control all, click on open, click on OK. So now this is Selenium WebDriver. Now go to SRC, take the new class, class property. Keep the mark public start wide menu, click on finish. Yesterday we discussed with the XPath, today concept of property. Property file tomorrow I will teach you, today I will teach you only property. So web driver, WD, reference equal to new hello din lo old version teeskodam le reject chestundi laptop a laptop vaste adi ni face recognize cheyakunna cheyakunda open avvaledu password asal option raavadam le face recognize cheyadam led ani cheppi ichestundi asal password an option raavatla ledu Okay, okay, so in class long now, bye. Ah, chappani. Webdriver WD called new Firefox driver. <coughs> so, with Webdriver reference, we can open any site. WD dot. Get. Get. HTTP. Facebook dot com. So yesterday we discussed XPath, today we will take another property, ID property. Find element. WD dot, find element. Find element. By dot, ID, today I am taking ID. Okay. ID I am giving here. I know ID, how to get the ID? See, username ID, username ID is email, copy. Okay. Come here, control V dot send keys id is akil ready h o i d one at <coughs> gmail dot com next password wd dot find element by dot ID. I am giving ID. Okay. I am giving ID. So go and get the ID. Password ID. Pass. Okay. Copy. Come here. Paste here. Dot. Send keys. Mm. dot okay sense to you huh? yes very very case sense <laughs> venkanna mm. venkanna one fourth next we need to click on sign in button so wd dot find element by dot XPath. I'm giving the XPath. XPath in the name? Oh, oh, ID. Dot. Click. Click. You can give anyone. There is no uh, rules and regulations. And the other thing is that you can give anyone. Yes. 
sign in button X path. Sorry, ID. Login button. ID name is login button. Copy. Come here. Paste here. Control. Save. Click on that. Yes. Login. So this is the properties. Using yesterday we have taken X path. Today we discussed with the ID property. Or any other property. Not only ID property. If you want to take any other property, you can take it. Name property, value property, you can take it. Just so we are not ID X path or different properties which could work out as run just not. Yes. You can give any property and export. Okay. It didn't just practice it. Sorry, Pina import 